Hello everybody and a good day to you all. Today I'm talking about Sesame Street. Because Sesame Street is moving to HBO. And don't worry, they're still going to appear on PBS. But because of this new partnership, Sesame Street usually produces 18 episodes. But after, but after, this, after this new um, merger, I guess you should say, they're going, to be, they're going to be producing 35 episodes. And they're going to get a spin-off series. Because first, they're going to appear on HBO. And then after a nine-month window, those same episodes are going to appear again for free on PBS. Because of this, it, Sesame Street is going to get the funding that it needs to continue on in educating and entertaining children that they, they have been doing, and doing quite well, for the past 45 years. 45 years of great, fun entertainment that children can learn from and enjoy. Because when you think of the best children programming, you think Sesame Street. Because I grew up watching Sesame, Sesame Street and I have been enjoying it for a long, long time. Even to this day, I still watch it at, at, at some times. Just to, just to check in, to see how things are. Just to see how things change from how it used to be to how it is now. Because I subscribe to it on YouTube. So every so often when I, 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 I want to know what's going on in Sesame Street, I just turn into it just to see what's happening. Because when I first started watching Sesame Street, Sesame Street had Kermit the Frog on it. And he should report the news. And, and I used to watch the Muppet Show as well. So I got this, wow, Kermit, he got two jobs. I mean, he's on, he's on the Muppet Show and Sesame Street. Amazing. I was young at the time. All I knew, he, he was working for two, for two things. I was like, wow, he got two jobs. I was, I was, so it, it amused me. And it, it, Sesame Street has changed a lot over the years, but it's still great and fun entertainment. And to think that a world where Sesame Street does not exist anymore kind of scares me. Oh my gosh. But thanks to, the, to HBO, the same network that brought us Game of Thrones. And we all know what happens on that show. A lot of freaky stuff. Stepped up to make sure Sesame Street can continue and help our children learn how to read, how to count, how to get along with one another. The teachers all the life, beautiful, beautiful life lessons like us that would stay with us through our whole lives. I mean, even to this day, songs from Sesame Street still stick with me. Every so often, this happens every so often, this song pops into my head. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. No matter what it happens, no matter where I'm at, that song will pop into my head. Let me know I'm singing it. I'm pretty sure some of you probably still, to this day, how much song for Sesame Street you heard, or sing a song you heard for Sesame Street. Maybe you do, maybe you don't, but I know I do. And thanks to HBO, we're still going to get to this show. Because, like I said before, boy, having, H having Sesame Street gone, oh my God, that would be a, a huge loss for so many children. So leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought about Sesame Street. Do you love it? How, how much how, how much a part of life was it, was it for you? And how did it help mold you into the person you are today? Leave your comments down below. I'm also going to leave a link down to the to um to the to the article that shows you more in depth about what the, the, the partnership between HBO and Sesame Street. And I'm also going to leave down a link to a um I, I did a, um a review on a documentary called I Am Big Bird. And this is about the man who plays Big Bird as well as Oscar the Grouch. And he, he has been part of Sesame Street since the beginning. And he still, and he still plays Big Bird till this very day. If you haven't seen I Am Big Bird, I say check it out. I highly recommend it. It's a great documentary. If you love Sesame Street, I think you should watch this. It's very moving and touching and inspirational as well. So that's all I have to say about that. Give my channel a big old like. Hit the thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and share. I really would appreciate it. So like I always say, in my dreams and in real life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. Sesame Street is the best. And thank you for all the entertainment. Peace out, people.